bro. I love you, bro. I love right? you too, fam. I love you, bro. The ambush of rapper XXX Tentacion as he prepared to leave. You are all gods of One of the men goes into his car. Then there's a confrontation and a robbery, and the men shoot and kill the talented young artist. Jazzy Dwayne Ricardo Onfroy, he has known XXX Tentacion or simply X, was a rapper, singer, and songwriter. He was born on January 23rd, 1998, and rose to fame through his unique blend of hip hop, RB, and punk rock. X music was characterized by its raw emotion, interception, and honesty, reflecting his trouble upbringing and personal struggles. Despite his controversial image and criminal record, X amassed a massive following and became one of the most influential artists of his generation. On June 18, 2018, X was shot and killed in a part robbery, leaving behind a legacy that continues to inspire and captivate audience around the world. Recently, new details have come to light in the investigation into his murder. Killers can be imprisoned for life. Today I will tell you more about this incident and investigation. Please subscribe to the channel and like this video so that I can post videos more often. X childhood was characterized by poverty, neglect, and violence, and his father was absent for most of his life. X attended various schools, including Piper High School in Sunrise, Florida, but dropped out in the 10th grade. He was involved in a number of criminal activities during his youth, including armed robbery and drug dealing, which ultimately led to his arrest and imprisonment. Despite his troubled past, X found solace in music and began to develop his unique styles of rap. X began to gain recognition for his music in 2015, when he released his debut single News Flock on SoundCloud. He quickly amassed a large following on the platform, and his unique style of rap, which blended elements of hip hop, RB, and punk rock, garnered him a significant fan base. X debut studio album 17 was released in August 2017 and received positive reviews from critics. The album addressed themes of depression, suicide and self-harm, reflecting X's personal struggles with mental health. X's second studio album Question Mark, released in March 2018, debuted at number one on the Billboard 200 chart and featured collaborations with Travis Barker, Joe Badass and PNB Rock. Despite his success, X's career was dogged by controversy due to his criminal record and allegations of domestic abuse. He was accused of assaulting his then-girlfriend Geneva Ayala on multiple occasions, and the accusations were corroborated by a number of witnesses. X denied the allegations, but they continued to haunt him throughout his career. In 2016, X was arrested on charges of aggravated battery of pregnant victim, false imprisonment, and witness tampering. He was placed under the house arrest and later released on bail, but the charges remained pending at the time of his death. On June 18, 2018, X was leaving a motorcycle dealership in Deerfield Beach, Florida, when he was shot and killed in a apparent robbery. The incident occurred in broad daylight, and witnesses reported seeing two men fleeing the scene in a black SUV. X was transported to a nearby hospital, where he was pronounced dead. The news of his death sent shockwaves throughout the music industry, with fans and fellow artists mourning his passing. The investigation into X's death was led by the Broward County Sheriff's Office. The police released a statement shortly after the shooting, stating that they believed it was a robbery gone wrong and that X was targeted specifically. They later arrested and charged four men in connection with the shooting, including Trevor Newsom, Michael Bortright, Dedrick Williams and Robert Allen. Newsom and Bortright were both charged with the first-degree murder, while Williams and Allen were charged with accessory to murder. A few years later it became known that Dan, sitting in his BMW i8, X was going to go shopping for the motorcycle. Robbers have been following him for a long time. Amfro had several tens of thousands of dollars in his bag. After the robbers shot the rapper, they took the money. We recently learned about X's final words. What's all this for? But it just became known that all those accused of killing the rapper were found guilty of murder in his first degree. The jurors deliberated for 27 hours before reaching their verdict. Now the killers face life in a prison without the possibility of parole. It's amazing that one of the main facts in his life is directly related to place of his death, and it led such a legacy. I will talk about it at the end. X death was a tragic loss for the music world, but the legacy continues to inspire and captivate audience around the world. X music was raw 
raw and emotional, and his honest lyrics spoke to the struggles that many young people face today. His popularity on social media was unmatched with millions of followers on platforms like Instagram and Twitter. X was also known for his philanthropy, donating to a number of charitable causes, including hurricane relief efforts in his home state of Florida. X's influence on the music industry continues to be felt today. Many artists credit X with inspiring them to be more open and honest in their music, and his unique blend of rap, R&B and punk rock has influenced a new generation of musicians. In 2019, a posthumous album entitled Bad Vibes Forever was released, featuring collaborations with the numbers of artists, including Lil Wayne, Rick Ross and others. As a bonus, I would like to tell you the most interesting facts about the rapper that you may not have known. He was a fan of anime and Japanese culture, and even had a song titled Jocelyn Flores inspired by a fan he met in Japan. The rapper was a big fan of video games, and after stream himself playing games on the streaming platform Twitch. He was once homeless and slept in a friend's car for a period of time. X was a fan of alternative music and cited artists such as Nirvana and Red Hot Chili Peppers as influences on his music. He was a self-taught musician who learned how to play the piano and guitar through watching YouTube tutorials. Jazza was a fan of the horror genre and often incorporated horror elements into his music videos and artwork. He was a prolific writer who often wrote poetry and short stories in addition to his music lyrics. He had a fascination with the number 17, and of the reference to it in his music and artwork. The number also appears in the name of his record label, Bad Vibes Forever. And the most ironic fact. You all know the song said, this is the main song in Tentacion's career. The main part of the music from this song is made from the sound that plays multimedia in BMW i8. It's in the one in which the artist was killed. His music and his legacy continue to be celebrated by fans around the world. His story is a testament to the power of music to inspire, connect and heal, and his impact on the music industry will be felt for years to come. While his death was a tragic loss, his music and his message will live on, inspiring generations of young people to be more open, honest and true to themselves. While X legacy and impact on the music what are undeniable, his there also sparked a conversation about violence and gun control. X was only 20 years old when he was killed, and his death was a stark reminder of the dangers that many young people face in their communities. Gun violence is a pervasive issue in the United States, mass shootings and homicides occurring at the alarming rate. X dead highlighted to need for greater efforts to curb gun violence and to address the underlying social and economic factors to contribute to it. The investigation into X dead was complex and controversial. The police faced criticism for their handling of the case, with some fans and commentators alleging that they did not do enough to protect X or to bring his killers to justice. The case also raised questions about the effectiveness of Florida's stand your ground law, which allows individuals to use deadly force if they feel that their life is in danger. Ex-killers claimed that they acted in self-defense, which complicated the prosecution's case. In the wake of X's death, his fans and supporters organized a number of memorials and tributes to honor his memory. Vigils were held in cities around the world, and fans shared their favorite songs and memorials on social media. X's music continues to resonate with listeners, and his impact on the music industry remains as strong as ever. Subscribe to the channel, it's very important for me, then I can release videos more often. Write your opinion about this story and video in the comments and like it. Also watch other videos on my channel, there are links in the description. Thank you for watching, get in touch.